back and also sitting at your desk at work. Oh yes, this is boot camp. We've got Alex Vidan from Vidan Family Chiropractic joining us. Come on, people, get in shape, sit up straight, suck that gut in. What are they doing wrong over there, Alex? Well, I, I think that the big things are is that you definitely want to be sitting up nice and tall, nice and straight. It takes less strain on your low back and on your spine and on your neck and everything else. This guy so, right here, what's he doing wrong? <laughs> well, I think that the big thing for him is definitely sitting up straight at the desk so that yeah. you can sit properly so that your spine, you don't have the problems that people typically get. Now, Kelly, way back there in the back, she seems to be doing an okay job. She's doing a pretty good job. A little bit sitting forward as opposed to sitting up a little bit taller on, get is what that I'd neck like back. to see. There you go. Much better. There you Huge go. difference right there. Right there. All right. What about Matt so, over there? Matt's actually not doing too bad. Lean him forward just a little bit. That's not mm -hmm. a big of a, as big of a deal. Want to make sure that we're sitting up good and tall, that the monitor height, his monitor height is actually perfect for him. When he's looking straight ahead, he should be looking at that top portion of the screen. But is his neck straight enough? He could be a little bit taller. There you go. Matt, straighten that neck. Come on. See, that looks there perfect. You go. Very good. Perfect. Perfect. All right. I'm going to sit down right here, and this is going to show a good example of this woman. That is a perfect posture for sitting in a chair, correct? Exactly, exactly. That's exactly what we want to see. Actually, the only thing that I would change on this with the screen that we were just talking about there is the 90 degrees. You want to have it more to where 100, 110 degrees, you know, as far as your elbows and your knees go. The important thing is, is making sure that you're sitting up good and tall, that you're in a position where it takes pressure off of your neck, your upper back, your low back, your knees, things like that. You don't want to sit on your legs. You don't want to tuck your legs underneath your feet or underneath your body. Um, you want to make sure that that monitor height is at a good height for you. This monitor obviously isn't tall enough for you. We would need to raise it up so that whenever you're looking straight ahead, you should be looking at the top portion of the screen. So this monitor needs to be quite a bit higher for you. You can use phone books to build that up if you like. Monitor raisers, front and center. Raise those guys up. Yeah. As far as the keyboard height for you, that's perfect. That's You've perfect. got a nice angle for you. You can keep those wrists floating so that it doesn't put pressure on the inside of the wrist for carpal tunnel, problems like that. Feet need to be just a little bit further in front of you, okay. and that's going to bring to where you have less pressure on the low back as well. Dr. Alex so. Vidan, thank you so much. Thank you. I think you saved Fox, too, from a serious pain in the neck in the future. He's the best. Monica's